Archaeologists working in the Sahara have published their findings that describe the discovery of mysterious stone structures that are scattered throughout the largest desert in the world. The structures come in various sizes and shapes, and date back thousands of years, although researchers are not yet sure when they were built or what their purpose was. The archaeological map of Western Sahara remains literally and figuratively almost blank in regard to the international archaeological research community, particularly far from the Atlantic coast, writes Joanne Clark of the University of East Anglia and independent researcher Nick Brooks, authors of a new book that describes their work studying these unknown and mysterious structures. Clark and Brooks spent most of a decade studying these structures between 2002 and 2009, and have catalogued hundreds of them ranging from straight lines to rectangular platforms to giant or growing circles. A structure seems to be a combination of smaller shapes that include lines, stone circles and platforms, forming a structure over 600 meters long. It is believed that some of the structures mark the location of tombs, although most of the structures remain a complete mystery until more research can be done. However, due to security concerns, archaeologists cannot venture into the area due to the fact that terrorist groups such as Al-Qaeda operate in the region and foreigners are known to be kidnapped. For now, these structures will remain an enigma until Western Sahara can be effectively secured. While we are beginning to scratch the surface of what may be beneath the quicksand of the Sahara, these preliminary discoveries only further highlight how many chapters of hidden or unknown history may have been lost in the sands of time. The Sahara is full of mysterious ruins such as these stone structures that suggest great knowledge and long-lost civilizations.